Hello overnight guests and welcome back to Motel Manager Simulator. In the last episode we went ahead and opened up yet another room which is a good thing for us. I've got some rooms available here. I need to check which rooms are ready and which rooms I need to uh, still work on here. Gotta get used to the buttons because of the fact that I've been playing TCG Card Shop Simulator. So definitely used to those buttons going to take a little bit to get back into the groove here. All right. So I have been thinking, and I think what I'm going to do is have somebody actually help me with this issue here. We are going to hire another employee. Because I think we're at the point where we could afford to have another employee. So we're going to hire Evelyn here. Oh, no, we aren't, because I need to upgrade the staff room first before I can do that. That's going to cost me two grand, so we're just not going to do that for right now. All right, well, that means I need to get my button gear and put in some elbow grease. I was planning on hiring Evelyn to basically be the maid, um, have her do both the cleaning and the uh, laundry, but, yeah, going to have to hold off on that for right now. All right, let's go restock this room. That's good to go. Get this stuff, put it in here. Turn that on. Let's go in here. Do I have an order pretty much ready to go? Does look like we do. Looks like a bunch of stuff for the shop, so that'll be good. Let's get this stuff put into the room here. Not going to worry about facing labels forward right now because I want to get this room available for rent again. There we go. It's all good to go. So one is good. And we have four and five also to get taken care of. I should check the trash in one. I just thought about that. All right. Evidently trash was good there. Did I put on this order a new washing machine? Because I believe I wanted a new washing machine on here. Yeah, it is there. All right, perfect. Make sure we got the trash out of this room. Oh, and I missed the spot also. So that room I've stripped, I just need to get it ready to go then. Let's see about the trash. Trash is evidently good in that one as well. All right.
get this stuff put in the rooms so that I can. Alright, all that stuff's taken care of there. Let's grab toilet paper. All this stuff for room four. Those things are good there. Perfect. We got about 40 seconds left on that. Then we should be able to open these rooms up for rent because we will have one ready to go and one is pretty much ready to go. Actually, you know what? Leave that open just to make sure we got that good there. All right. We're going to head over here, collect the money from our different uh, items. Then we'll deal with that laundry. There we go. Decent amount of income coming in. Perfect. Speaking of income, how are our ads doing? Let's get paid for those. Let's get this ordered. Let's go ahead and open up the motel. So these two have to go over here. Oh no, that's a towel. I don't need a towel. Alright, that one's good. I have just an extra towel here. put these over in the third room or in the fifth room I mean so we're needing one more sheet on it and then we should be good Get our fuel taken care of there. Alright, so we're good on all those things. 
I think I may save up the money to get the two grand in order to get another employee in. And so that way I can have somebody that's just taking care of the trashes and the nice sweeping. Day. All that stuff. Just to make my life a bit easier. I don't know if she will use the laundry machine where I have it stationed right now in my office or if I need to move it back to the warehouse in order for her to use it. All right, so cleaning, we'll clean the shop, clean the office, clean the rooms. Doesn't say anything about empty the trashes. Yeah, let's change the one girl that we have who's doing the warehouse into housekeeping. See what she does. All right, she's now changed her role. She's standing around in here right now, and that could be because the laundry's uh, running, but I'm not positive. That's quick. Basically, I want to see what happens once the laundry is done, which it is now. See if I put this stuff over in the warehouse, if she'll do anything with it. Nope, still not doing anything with it. So let's see about taking the washing machine, putting it over there. In the warehouse and see what she does with it. Alright, so let's put this there. That there. She gonna do anything with it yet? Nope, still not doing anything with it. Alright, so let's see if I put these dirty clothes back onto the bed over here. Will she do anything about that? I can't, because I already put the clean clothes on there. But I did miss a spot. Alright, so that's now got dirty clothes on it. See what happens. All right. Great. Well, something's happened because she's no longer there. Where'd she go? Yeah, you're over there. That's fine. All 
I'm really not sure on this. Oh, she's still just standing around. All right. Well, I don't need her for that now. I'll be fine without it. Let's go ahead, switch her real fast. To cleaning, because I could use that. Let's also pay the staff, because I don't want to have an issue with that. All right, she should come and clean that here soon enough. All right, yeah, she's doing that, so that works out fine. Oh. No, I really don't want him to have the dirty bit. Amazing. All right. That's my screw-up, I think. Because I think I tested on the wrong bed. Actually, let's take these two items. Thanks a bunch. You're welcome. Close the motel now. All right. Get this. Put it back there. Let's go to management. Yeah, I'm not sure now that it's worth having another person. Because the didn't seem like they really did the housekeeping. So, I'm not sure on that one. This is what I wanted. You can deal with the rest of it. <laughs> this thing is massive, and it looks definitely... Oh, heck no, I'm not. Excuse me, folks. I just gotta go deal with an issue over here. Everybody just continues as normal. I need to take these back over with me. Yeah, as I said, uh, not really sure about that whole housekeeping thing. Maybe when I have a room that gets dirty this time, I will just, uh, I'll try the housekeeping thing and see how it works. I won't even touch the key. I'll just put it out there and just leave it. But not exactly sure on that one. A little bit confused. Yeah, this one can fit so much more in it. Oh yeah, got to plug it in though. All right, so lock that in place, lock that in place. And it takes a minute 30. Oh, I like that. That's faster and it's uh, able to hold a lot more. Perfect, exactly what I wanted.
I guess we're going to have to put this one. Uh, we'll just put it over there for now. Want to get this stuff in so she can start actually stalking instead of just taking out of the van. There you go. You're good to go. Let me pick up the money over here while I'm here. Alright, let's see. We have rooms for rent. Actually, they're all pretty far off. This one's the next one that'll be available. I am curious with that, but not sure I want to wait for it or not. Uh, let's see here. We can get in our room here, so let's go ahead and do that. Alright, this was the corner room it looks like, so I think this room's actually a little bit bigger. So that is something to sort of keep in mind. Uh, we need to put in our order for all the stuff we need that I know I need to begin with. So let's get one of those, two of those, two of those, two of those, two of those, one of those, and one of those. One of those, one of those. We already got towels, so we're good there. Get that. That. Two blinds, as well as a shower curtain. As I said, I think this room is bigger, so I wouldn't mind putting in some other furniture. Like this sofa, actually. Let's try that. Uh, we're going to get two of those. those, two of those, two of those, one of those, that, that, this, ooh, we might put in a little kitchenette even in this area, we'll have to see on that, but it is a possibility, get that, and that, Along with that, and that. That one. That one. Oh, some benches might be nice outside places. All right, we need that, that, that that and that I want my Velociraptor statue so we're going to get that as well alright and we're going to of course have to have the big truck for this it's actually not all even going to fit in the big truck it looks like alrighty let's go ahead and turn our light on There we go. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and have her help us some here. Management, staff, don't worry about the warehouse right now. Go ahead back to cleaning.
I'll help you a little bit over here. Get this cleaning done. We're going to need some more fuel as well, Thank so you. we'll get that. She is throwing the trash away though, so that is great. You know what? We're gonna upgrade that. Which means this room is gonna be further off, but that's fine. Can't quite fill it up. But we can get close, and that'll be a good thing. Actually, you know what? I'll pick up these things. Because she can't seem to stack them. And then I want to see if she'll throw stuff into a trash bag. Yes, she will. All right, well, that's good to know. And now she's sweeping up. Perfect. I do like her for that. I mean, cleaning-wise, having the person wouldn't be a bad thing. But doesn't seem like the actual uh, housekeeping they're that good at. I think I am going to wait till the next guest checks out and then have her possibly uh, take care of the room. So I think we're getting close to that time period. Let's see. Yeah, we got about six minutes left. Right now I got her doing cleaning. Let's go ahead and get this out. There we go, that's good there. Let's go ahead and unlock this and this. Put that there. We'll take these over, put them into the warehouse, and then we'll see what she does with them. All that's locked in place now. You just sort of follow me around for right now? That's fine. Let's go ahead though and have it where you do the housekeeping. So I'm going to set you as that is your job. Staff. Housekeeping. Let's pay everybody. So that way everybody is good. No, I want housekeeping for yours. There we go. So right now you should be wearing the black vest. 
wherever you went to. Possibly over here. Yeah, you're over there, which is fine. It's perfectly fine. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and take my cart over to the other room there because we can get started on it here in a few moments. As I said, I do believe that this room is bigger. Definitely looks bigger. So I can put the bed and such over here. And as I said, I could put like a little kitchen net in, which would be a nicety, I think. So let's go ahead and add in, as far as electric, nice refrigerator. And a toaster. Oh, we gotta have a microwave. How are we doing as far as that room coming available? We got about two minutes left. Perfect. Plenty of time for me to go over here and start my work. Alright, that wall I can't do because that wall is going to become a room in the future. So that's fine. Let's grab this, go to the bathroom here, do our tile wall. Keep hearing doors opening and shutting. I'm waiting for that person to leave, but they have not yet. Alright, we are good on that. Don't think I'm going to be good on this tile. No. Alright, so I am going to need some more tile, definitely, on the order. Floor. I need two of those and actually let's go with three of those. There we go. Don't know what's going to happen when it doesn't all fit into one vehicle. <laughs> sort of curious about that. As I said, I'm also curious as to what happens when uh, Let's see here. So these people are checking out. She's going to prance past the door. Her buddy's going to go over there and uh, sit by the door. Thank you. We will say thank you to them. 
will open the door. And she just stands there. Completely useless. Alright. Yeah, so the housekeeping, I... If you guys know what I'm doing wrong, please let me know because I'm very curious. I was thinking maybe I had glitched it out because I had, uh... Well, now where'd she go, though? Oh, no, she's still there. Alright. Let me see here. Maybe I need to go into the computer and tell her? That's a possibility, I guess. Uh, management, staff... Assignments. No. Rooms. Yeah, that's just not working. So let's go ahead and have her switch to cleaning for right now. Because that'll be a better thing for me. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five, six. That one's going to go over there. Thanks Thank you. Alright. So we'll get her to do cleaning. She can hopefully go into the rooms and clean because, yeah, that'll at least be helpful to me. For now, though, I need to go ahead and grab this. There we go. Yeah, I'll have her do the cleaning, then she can go back to her warehouse duties because she's sort of useless to me as a... Uh... as the maid, which I'm sort of surprised about. I had expected that she was gonna work fine for that. And it turns out I was wrong. That's a cute car there. Uh, she does go right through walls, though. That's sort of creepy. Oh, that wasn't the room. Alright, this is the room. Let me grab all this stuff. Now, this is where I am happy, I think. Yes, I just shoved all that into that machine there. This one's clean, so I don't need to take it. There we go. She's doing some job. I'm happy enough with that. Oh yeah. I really like that washing machine. That's definitely a nicety. Alright. Now let's go ahead and switch her back to doing the warehouse because she's good at that. Alright, so this looks like it won't fit everything in. Yeah, we can't fit it, all of this in at the same time. So let's go ahead and cut some of the items here anyways. Like my statue has to be cut. Because it evidently takes up an enormous amount of space. I am curious about that statue now. And we'll cut the refrigerator. Now it should all fit. So now we just need to save up the money for it. That'll be easy enough to do. We will get that hopefully done in the next episode. Uh, we've still got some stuff we can do over there. And we've done some really good things like expanding our fuel station and such. 
As I said, now if you know what I'm doing wrong with the uh, the maid service, please let me know because I am curious. I want to do better with it. I want it to work, but obviously something I'm doing is not going correctly. Uh, let's see here. So we got the flooring down other than in the bathroom. Let's go ahead and start painting. You know what? I'm going to actually do this room this way. Because this would be a lot of blue otherwise. All right, all that's taken care of. I know the episode's going a little bit long here, but I do sort of want to get this room reasonably set up. That way, next episode, when we get all the items in, I can just put them in, and we can open up the room, hopefully. After I send for another truck, since uh, I'm evidently going to need an extra truck, particularly for that statue. I wonder how big that statue is. I'm actually excited for that now. You know what? Come to think of it. Hold on a second. No, I don't want to take everything out I've already put into the... I was debating actually just sending for the statue. But I want to get this order done because I've put everything in there already and be silly to have to redo that whole order. It was a lot of stuff. But I am very curious then of getting that statue in. I was just thinking it was something I could put on my desk. But uh, it might be bigger than that. It might be something that uh, is an outside sort of statue. Don't know. We'll have to see. Looks like we are going to need some white paint as well. I don't know if I've been painting the door jams on most of these rooms or not. That is something I am unsure of. Huh. Something I should look at in some of these rooms. Hopefully I have been, because that would be a shame if I haven't been. But it's an easy enough fix. We can definitely take care of that in the next episode. Or whenever a room becomes available. All right, so throw these cans away. She's back to running around with items and such, which is fine. Do a little bit of sweeping around here. Get that cash collected. Oh, I should have the stuff ready here in the machine. I completely forgot about that. 
And this lady's looking to check out also. Thanks. So, was going to end the episode right there, but you know what? Let me go ahead and take care of these rooms a bit. Alright, so that one's now available. Alright, so we've got the towel here. We got a towel for the other one. I do love that washer. That washer's so good. Alright, so that room is taken care of as far as that stuff goes. That room is taken care of as far as that stuff goes. Get these things. Throw them in the washing machine. Not even a trouble for that washing machine. I got two mouthwashes. Yeah, that's it. I did, but that's all right. We'll put one there. One of them right there. Turn off the light because the light is just too bright in these situations. There we go. That stuff's there. Alright, so all this room needs is the air freshener and it's uh, towel and sheet and blanket and it's good to go. Alright, so we still need one more mouthwash for the other room. Two of those. Let's get what we can here. That goes there. Put this in this room. in the motels. Take that. And hopefully I grabbed one of those as well. Toilet roll here. That goes there. Room one, I believe, is pretty much done now. Yeah, room one is done. It's ready to be rented again. Need two of those, two of these, one of those, I believe. So this room is also ready to be rented. Yep, we will be with you in just a moment, ma'am. Hard to tell if I did paint the door jams or not because the, uh, the doors block it. So 
I'm gonna go with I had painted the door jams. Oh shoot. Him showing up just made me realize I haven't sold this guy's body yet. There we go. <laughs> Nothing to see here, officer. Sure, take that room. Have a nice day. That'll work fine. Just a second, sir. Getting some toilet paper out for rooms. All right. Hold on. We'll get you that one. There you go. Take this room. Thanks a bunch. There you go. Uh, delivery. Build pieces. Paint. There we go. Alright, we got one last person coming in here. We'll get her the last room we have for right now. There we go. Alright. Oh, sorry if you want some rooms. We don't have any more. We're all booked up now. Yeah, and employees assigned to that cash register like because I need them that. there. All right. We're actually doing really well on cash right now, so that's great. Yep, we're going to have to throw these two people out. Sorry about that, folks, but we just don't have the rooms. And you're actually making my floor a mess anyways, buddy, so uh, get out. This is too bad. It is too bad. Very unfortunate. You'll live, though. Hey, you know what? I just told him the same way. We don't have rooms right now. We're all out of rooms. Uh, we have the money for this, though, so let's go ahead and put in that order. All right, so in the next episode, that order will come in and we will go ahead and fit out that room over there and we will continue from there. Let's see where we are on fuel. We're actually pretty good on fuel still for right now. Get that money in. Let's put in that money towards fuel just to make sure we're good. Uh, yeah. There we go. All right, so with that, if you enjoyed what I did in this episode, please go ahead and click that like button. If you've not already, please subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon, so that you're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you, and I hope to see you all again for more of Motel Manager Simulator.